Yo! What up, YouTube? What's up, family? You know what I'm saying? By myself and shit. But you know, we still gotta keep these shits rolling. Ain't made a, we ain't made a video in a minute, so shit, goddamn. I don't fucking know, but today I'm about to react to this old UDY. This, uh, hold on. This loyalty test. Military veteran tests his girlfriend. Will she cheat on military boyfriend? Insane loyalty test. Now, honestly, if you got to set up a loyalty test, bro, you it's over with. Like, <laughs> you might as well just give up, bro, and not even have to, not even date no more, bro. Like, if you if you don't trust somebody that much, much, you might as well just give up on the relationship, bro. If you ain't got no trust in the relationship, then it's like, what's the point of that shit, man? You got to set up, you going to UDY and shit, setting up loyalty tests and shit. I mean, shit. I ain't say I wouldn't do it. I wouldn't. Not, I, don't, I don't think I would. I mean, shit. If I feel like she ain't loyal, I got to, for me, I got to see something. Like, to make me think, oh, she not loyal for real. I got to see different uh, behavior or some shit. But anyway, I ain't finna yap. Uh, let's get into this shit. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications, and shit. Let's get into it. Let's do it, nigga. Hit on Bianca, ask her to leave Warren, and then take her on a date. What's up, guys, and welcome back to a brand new girlfriend's up. Bianca was... Today, we helped a U.S. Air Force veteran named Warren place his girlfriend, Bianca, to an right, epic okay. loyalty test. Alrighty, Warren, so this is where we're going to be at. We're going to be hiding and listening in in here as everything happens inside the apartment and stuff. And yeah, Warren wanted to find out if his girlfriend, Bianca, was truly loyal to well, him Well, honestly, not. he in the military, so it's like, I get it. I get it. Because he in the military. But still, like, I feel like if you're in the military, you shouldn't even be in a relationship, honestly, like. You in the military, you get sent out and shit for months, probably shit, whatever, years, I don't know, months. Shit, your girl got any, she could do anything she want. Y'all don't be having phones and shit like that and connectivity and shit like that where y'all could talk every day. Even even then, like, nigga could be right next to her talking to her. I mean, laying, laying right next to her while you talking to her. Niggas keep it pee like that for real, bro. Niggas don't, niggas don't give a fuck if these bitches got motherfucking... Husbands and boyfriends, nigga, shit. That nigga sit right there quiet as a fuck until she off the phone. So we hired our friend Andy to hit on Bianca, ask her to leave Warren, and then take her on a date. What's up, guys, and welcome back to a brand new video. I honestly hope hey, you guys are ready for this one because this one has a crazy twist that none of us oh, saw coming. So you're a retired military Air Force guy. Right. Oh, he's Man. Retired. He's retired. Oh, so shit. Did you ever in your life think you would be in this situation? No, never in a million years. You so how'd you come across like one of our, where, you said your friend showed you one of our videos yeah, and stuff? Yeah, one of my buddies showed me one of his videos and I thought, I was like, man, maybe I need to check this out. <laughs> Fuck you mean check it out, bro? Yo ass, thank your, your girl, not loyal, so shit. Oh shit, I fucked up. Man, hold on, bro. Alright, we good. See what, what? You think your girl not loyal and shit, or wife or whatever, not loyal, so you on this, about to see if UDY can catch her ass. I don't know, bruh. I can't sit there and think, like, I can't sit there and fathom some shit, like, damn, bro, is this girl really loyal for real? Man, bruh, fuck. Like, that shit gonna be in my head all day, so it's like, why not, why put yourself through that? Why keep putting yourself through that? I don't even know what the fuck I'm talking about. What will happen? So this test would be taking place in our very own apartment, and our roommate Denzel would be helping us with it as well. Oh, See, there are always nigga. people looking for somewhere new to live for various reasons, and thanks to Warren, we knew that Bianca was one of those people. Bianca was looking for a new place to live, and thanks to Warren, we knew that she couldn't afford a studio or one-bedroom apartment all on her own. So she was open to the possibility of having roommates. Well, we took advantage of this information and had Andy advertise Denzel's room on Craigslist for five hundred dollars right. plus bills, Woo! we then sent the listing to Warren, and he was wow, responsible honey. for convincing Bianca to get in contact with Andy to at least come check out the room. Now we live in California, and rent out here is dumb expensive. So five hundred dollars for a room is actually quite a steal. So it's dumb. A one bath for twenty five. 
to 2600 Nigga, what? I mean, I get it's LA, but damn, nigga. Our shits be like 12, shit. Some of them be like nine, like a studio. Some of them be like nine. Some of them be like 1100. 25 to 2600. Yeah, fucking right. Um, expensive. So $500 for a room is actually quite a steal. So we were pretty confident that Warren wouldn't have any issues convincing Bianca to come check out the room. Then you got the fucking water and shit, trash and shit. Hey, Bianca, this is Andy. Oh, hey, Andy. How's it going? Good, good. Hey, so I was actually uh, calling to see if we're still up for today. Um, for the, for the room? For the room, yes. For the room that we have? Yeah, yeah, I was still planning on it. Okay, sounds good. What Bianca didn't know, though, is that an even better deal was right around the corner because in the event of her coming over, Andy would show her the room and then offer to give it to her for free if she agreed to go on a date with him. The oh, fuck, no. I don't care. You gotta go on a date, bro. Like, <laughs> fuck it. Like, you gotta go on the date, bro. Like, free room, bro. You think she would consider it, like, trading you for a place to live for free? I definitely would hope not. Okay. Um, well, how long they been together? Like, she don't live with that nigga or no shit? Obviously, she's trying to find a room but it's like I don't know bro she about to trade that nigga for that room for free nigga but we, we'll see so with that the stage was now set for our test to begin soon we will find out if Bianca remains loyal to Warren or if she trades him for another guy and a free place to live I hope you guys have your talkies because you guys already know this shit's, this shit's gonna, gonna be good. good. This shit's gonna be good. Bruh, of course the fuck are going yeah. big. Play the official ah. PC version of Clash of Clans with Google Play Games. Download and skip, nigga. So are you prepared for Warren the possibility versus Bianca. that she might fail this test? Or I am prepared. Bianca. You are prepared? Oh yeah. Is it like if she fails, like that's it? That's where I'm at, bro. I, I told you, I'm I'm too old for this. I, I, I was gonna I, say games I, I do not want to play. Though. Yeah. Everything and everyone were set up and ready to go. All we were waiting on for this test to begin was for was Bianca to arrive. Oh, she would be giving Andy a call when she was here. What's the whole reasoning that you want to like place her to the test? Uh, there's certain things that I just noticed that she does. She just always evasive. You know, she got somewhere to go. She was going with some friends, but she never tells me uh, who the friends are. So. Right. So have you tried? talking to her about it and everything i have and she always tries to uh you know deflect the questions or she'll just avoid it all together i feel it and and quite frankly bro i'm tired of it i, I don't have time for the game so i feel it where the hell she at i don't know she was supposed to call me she need to hurry the hell up because i got things to do shut your well, ass up hour. nigga you agree to this shit she play right down the street bro it's been an hour and a half yeah shit i might go get me some chick-fil-a Bianca should have been here by now, but it appeared that she was running behind in, schedule. She's confirmed that she would be here later today, well, which is basically now. I'm not too worried about it, though. I don't think she's flaking. I just think maybe it's traffic or maybe, I don't know, something's going on with the car or something. I don't know. To be certain that she was still on her way, though, Andy decided to check in with her. And you know what? As we wait for her to arrive, let me tell you guys about the amazing sponsor of this video. It was an amazing base PL app. Here's some competes and actually opportunity to soul, right? Joined a battle for it to my super fun. It was a hundred download link. You get five dollars. Twenty downloaded the ash. God damn! For another ten to fifteen minutes for Bianca to. Okay, back to the video now. We ended up waiting for another ten to fifteen minutes for Bianca to arrive. She was running late, but nonetheless, she was still on her way. Let's see, go. Oh, Andy's receiving a call. Hello. There's on the other go. line of that phone call was Bianca informing Andy that she had finally arrived. He didn't put the phone on speaker, so we can't really hear. I think it's her. Okay, sounds good. I'll go downstairs and I'll uh, get you real quick. All right. Is that her? Yeah, that's her. 
Nigga, Finally, not. dude. There's a confirmation. Okay, so it's her. Whew. Alrighty, guys, so Bianca has arrived. Andy right now is heading outside and going downstairs to grab Bianca and bring her upstairs, and yeah. So Andy isn't immediately gonna be making his move. First, he's gonna let Bianca check out the apartment and the room that she's interested in renting out. Remember, that room is actually Denzel's, so we're having him there pretending to be moving out. Oh my gosh, I actually broke it. <laughs> Come on, man. Just be normal, bro. Just be, like, be cool, bro. <laughs> awesome, bro. Oh my so we're having him there pretending to be moving out. Look at him. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, my gosh. I actually broke it. <laughs> <laughs> be wrong, go wrong. <laughs> After letting Bianca check out the room, Andy would then walk her over to the living room. The there he would go over some more details about the apartment, answer any questions that Bianca might have, get to know her a little bit more, and then finally make his move. Alrighty guys, That's this is it. it. So after having waited a little longer than expected, this test was finally about to begin. Alright, coming in. Cool, man. Yeah, I know, bro. Who the fuck is Who's that? Running? That's her brother or some shit? Who's the guy? Okay, so this caught us completely off guard and by surprise. Be no fucking way she just did that. Okay. So yeah, I know, bro. That pool's lovely. What the Who fuck is the that? Guy? Okay, so this caught us completely <laughs> off guard and by surprise. Bianca had arrived, but she brought another guy with her as well. Do you recognize him at all? Brother? Does he look familiar? Like, mm -hmm. Cousin? Yeah, but this is it. I mean, this is the apartment right here. Living room, kitchen, I like to see around. So you don't you don't recognize you don't recognize him whatsoever at the all. The nigga said no. <laughs> so she go down. The nigga said no. No. What are you thinking? What's going through your mind right now? It's a lot of stuff going through. I, I don't know who the guy is. See, there's a washer and dryer. You can oh. more than. She would know if she had a brother. Like, I mean, he would know she would have a. He would know she would have a brother, and he would know how the brother looks, right? If they dating. Awesome. We had no idea who this guy was, and we needed to figure that out because this could potentially throw things off. I'm not gonna lie to you guys here. Because we're conducting a loyalty test, the first thought that got into my mind was, oh my God, this guy is her freaking Sancho. But then I was like, yo, let me not jump to conclusions here. If you think right, about that'll it, mess up. That'll mess up the whole plan they got and shit. So what, what, I wonder what they'll do if that's, if that's his, her side piece. I mean, already she's not being loyal. So they might as well just cut it, cut it, cut it. Oh, well, just cut it short. Shit, go on then. With you to check out a stranger's home yeah. is actually not uncommon. And quite frankly, the smart thing to do. Who knows? Right, maybe right. this guy was just her friend, her coworker, or maybe he was even family. Okay, so right now, Andy yeah, is showing Bianca so. and this other person, this other guy, the room. Coworker though, like. Or a friend, like, you could have asked your boyfriend to to go with you, bro. Maybe that's her brother, her friend, cousin, I, co-worker, I don't know. I guess, she, I guess, I guess he don't know how the brother look. <laughs> or, you know, I guess he don't know about a brother, huh? Skip, man, come on, bro, what the fuck? Hi, guys. Hi, what's up? This is Bianca. What's your name? I'm Bianca. Hi, Bianca Denzel. Nice to meet you. Ooh, girl, your hands was, oh, that was, that was a good shape. <laughs> Made me feel like I'm a little girl. Oh, hey, my hey, God. Hey. Hi, <laughs> Denzel, you as well. Pretty good, just <clears throat> now. Let me just move this real quick. Okay, so now we know his name is Chase, but we still have no idea what his relationship with Bianca is. Right, right, right. Maybe she just didn't feel safe about coming to the apartment, so she wanted to bring a friend with her. That's why she brought him. Okay. Maybe, uh, maybe. right? Yeah, Give her the benefit shit. of the doubt. So this is the room. It looks pretty tight right now, just because he's moving around, but it is yeah, spacious. Yeah, get, get comfortable, y'all. Y'all ain't got to be scared. Yeah, yeah so this is spacious. For you guys do have a little walk. What day do you have to move by? So why, how come you're moving? Um, just to be closer to work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I actually have a new job at Disneyland, so. At Disneyland? Yeah. Oh, do do? Um, I am a performer. Right yeah. Did she, like, when you sent her the listing, did she mention that she was going to be coming with someone, or did she ask you to come no. with her? I, well, I know you told her that you were going to be working, right. but oh, okay. she didn't mention anything like that? No. So we weren't sure. That's why I should fucking listen. Sure who this guy Because I was like, he ain't asked her to come with him. I mean, he asked. 
She asked her him to come with her. Yeah. Because he told her he was going to be working. I was, and we didn't want to jump to any conclusions. But at the same time, we weren't entirely convinced that he was just a friend. That's what, what I'm we saying, were also like... about to realize is that Bianca bringing him with her, regardless of who he was, was about to pose an even greater problem. Oh my God! I, I seriously, how is how is Andy gonna make his move now? That's what I'm saying, like. Oh damn! I just thought of that. How was Andy supposed? Sergio thinking late, nigga. This nigga thinking late, bro. You gotta be on top of your shit, Sergio. This your job. This what you do. Supposed to make his move oh, with this other guy there. You're thinking I mean, don't late. get me wrong. Andy could be a savage and still go for it. But here's the Type thing: the guy simply being here, regardless of who he is, could ruin the integrity of this test. Now, like I because of him, could. Bianca may or may not answer honestly. Oh man. How long did you say you've been living here for? Three years. Oh, okay. Yeah. So this is actually the guest last year rest bathroom. Oh, okay. Um, so you have your own bathroom. Yeah, I do actually. If we wanted Where to keep this that? test going, we had to think of something fast. So I texted Denzel to come outside. Hopefully he could give us some input on who this yeah, Chase guy was. Like maybe we missed something. Phone. Maybe Where we could also phone? even improvise a plan to get Chase to leave Bianca and Andy by themselves. So what do you do for work? Like what's your schedule like? Are you here a lot? Excuse me. Um, well, I'm, I'm actually right self-employed. I'm gonna go take this to the trash. Okay, I'll right back. Yeah, no, I'm actually self-employed. I do e-commerce. What do you do for Denzel? Denzel so smart as fuck. I work at the outlets part time, but I also work from home. Oh, okay, sounds good. So I do like a few things. So I'm like around a lot. So, okay. Yeah. What do you do? OnlyFans. Oh, nice. No, I'm oh. Oh, so uh, Okay, here it comes Denzel. How was everything? It was cool. Who is the guy? She said they're together. Really? Oh my God. And you're. Why they didn't put that in the? You're 100 percent serious. Mm-hmm. Okay. Denzel has just confirmed the worst possible case scenario. According to him, Bianca is in fact dating this other guy. So you have Dang. other people like checking out the place? I know, yeah, so I actually What the fuck did she say that though? I texted Andy, but he hasn't texted me back yet. Oh really? Yeah, let me text him again. Like, who is that? Who is that question mark? Is that her boyfriend? We wanted to double check with Andy if Chase was in fact Bianca's boyfriend. Andy, because look if it at turned your out phone. to be true, well then this test was basically over. Unfortunately, though, Andy was deep into character and sticking to our original plan of walking Bianca over to the living room and stuff. A part of me honestly thought that Andy was going to go all the way and make his move on her, even with this other guy here. Any more questions you guys have? Um, no, I'm not looking at it. It's all you. I mean, what really matters, dude, is what you think about all this. What do you think about this? Do you think they're more than just friends? Oh, yeah. It's, uh, I'm pretty sure from what I'm saying, bro, and, and what he is saying is confirming. They look like they are items. They are sitting close. Bro. You never met him before? You never yeah, seen him like around or anything? No. Really? No. Not at church or like no. any events or anything? No, like I said, it's, it's good to know now. So we're approaching like the end of the month. And so I kind of have uh -oh. to put that, put okay. that hand on him. A couple days, on her. Okay. Pretty much. So I basically would probably let you know and pretty soon because I have to solidify it at last Andy pulled out his phone saw my messages and gave us the answer to my question found your mic huh found your mic it worked duh bitch oh shit what happened he just texted me that he said boyfriend some bullshit that's it Some oh my god it, it was now 100 percent with without a doubt confirmed and verified that bianca and chase were in fact more than friends doubt confirmed and verified that bianca and chase were in fact more than friends they were an actual why they didn't put that in the like why they didn't just show them saying a couple do you want to keep watching? Are you are you good? You don't want to see if anything else happens. You're good to. I've seen everything I needed to see. The crazy part about this video is that we came up with such an elaborate plan and setup in order to see if Bianca would fail. However, she ended up failing on her own accord. You can't lie and you can't hide from camera. Right. So we got it right here, brother. Conf conf confirm what what they date. Right. Were they gonna move into the room together? Do you know? Wow, that makes some sense. 
So now things are starting to click now why he's even well, there. He said, they might have been. I mean, I'm not living here. He said, I mean, I'm not living here. It's all you win. And planning to move in together into that room. Yeah, that changes things for me now. Oh, yeah. wow. From scale one to 10, what do you think about the place? How are you feeling? 7.5 right now. Okay. This is really good. I mean, I think like the price is awesome. Do you want to like walk in there and yeah, compare? Right. You, yes, you want to walk yeah, in there and bro, talk to her? Yes, I want to. Right, right. I'm not that kind of person that's going to cause a scene. I just need to hear her say it. And I can, I can move on and, and go on with my life because I don't have time to play games. And that's just period for me, bro. Warren has decided to have a conversation with Bianca and thankfully, quickly, Andy thought of a clever way to hold Bianca there as we made our way back inside. Um, if you still have time, we can go upstairs. I can show you the rooftop, the game room, the pool. And, um, but let's just hold on until Denzel comes back because he actually took the key. Oh, so yeah. let's just hold on for a huh? minute. We had absolutely no idea what was about to go down. We knew that Warren could handle himself. I mean, for crying out loud, the guy's a retired Air Force veteran, but we didn't know how this chase guy would react. Because of that, we just had to be ready for anything. Hopefully things wouldn't go down how one of our previous videos went down. But with that being said, guys, I want to thank you all for being here with me today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are ready for what's to come. And I hope you guys have your talk. This shit is going to be good. Know. This shit's going to be good. Bro, come on. Our so try our newest cheesy calzone epic stuffed crust pizza. Shut up real quick, nigga. Are you fucking kidding me? What's this? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? Hold on, bro. You gotta go in, like. Nigga gotta go in. More matter than that, bro. Like. Are you fucking kidding me, bitch? Oh, God, that sucks. Are you fucking kidding me? What's this? What the, what the, the fuck hell? is this? Yeah, what the hell is going on? Who are you? You're Bro, stalking me or some shit? Who tough. Who are you is crazy. <laughs> I don't even know. He don't even know about him, bro. That bitch is trifling. Who the fuck are you, bro? Who are you? you this your boyfriend? This entertainment team? This your boyfriend? How the, the fuck are you? Find me? What, what, what is this shit? Fuck. Bro, fuck you. I'm, I'm her boy. I'm. stood up i don't cap military gotta beat that nigga ass bruh that man stood up bruh who the fuck are you find me what, what, what is this shit? nigga fuck bro, you bro, fuck you i'm, I'm, I'm her boy i'm her boyfriend yeah Ch Ch nah bruh let him fight man damn let them niggas fight anything with you dude we're just really trying to just have like a conversation like i know you? you guys are in a relationship and stuff or at least that's what it looks <laughs> like but like the truth is like warren and bianca have also been in a relationship too like this that's entire tough. thing that we set up right now was actually all a test like we were trying to help warren find out if bianca would end up cheating on him so and stuff. Warren's got a whole ass crew. he yeah see he realizes not him it's her so the original for like three Month, yo. The, the original plan was to have Andy right over here ask you on a date. That's why, like, we had to come over. We had to check out the apartment. Like, the reality is, like, Andy doesn't even live here. Like, that room is not even for rent. Yes. Oh. But it was, it was, it, it, it was like just a plan to, to get you here, and then Andy was supposed to ask you on a date. But we obviously never got that far because we didn't. I mean, you walked in with Chase. So you've been like stalking me. You like have a whole ass team trying to like follow me around. I just wanted to know what the fuck was going on. Bro, oh, oh. shut the fuck up. Chill out, first of all. I've been her for three months, bro. Three months? That's nothing. It, 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 it's nothing if, if it was Three months? That is nothing, but I mean, it's something. She's still alive. I, for three months, bro. Three months? That's nothing. It, 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 it's nothing. If, if it was nothing, then you should have fucking told me that three months. That's been a fucking year. I no, wasn't I was fucking wasting some, my time. I've known you for a year. We were friends. Yeah, we've been dating, dating for a year. No? Since when did you think we were dating for a while? Oh, I didn't yeah, want to be dating. Fucking love, bro. Okay. Of course, is, I is, care is, about you. Did you, see, you care? Okay, you care about see, me. So I have just... I been? Why? Well, that shit's so crazy, bro. 
So I just been, didn't want to be demoted. exclusive with no one. Okay. What? Well, well, why the fuck did you not tell me that three months ago? I told you that what I the fuck you mean you ain't want to be exclusive with no one? With no one. Okay. Okay, you care about me now. So I just I've been, didn't want to be demoted. exclusive with no one. Okay. Well, well why the fuck did you not tell me that three months ago? I told what you that did, I didn't want to be exclusive with no one. No, I, I, I sure as hell no, you didn't tell me yeah. yourself. First of all, she looked youngest. Like she looked younger than this nigga. Wait, or oh, well, I don't know how she looked. But Chase, man, oh, shit. You trying to be exclusive? No. Why you want well, to? that's fine. If you didn't want to fucking be exclusive, you yeah. should have said that shit up front three months ago. I talked about not wanting Keeping to be exclusive. No, you didn't talk about. It. If that was the case, I wouldn't fucking be here today. I mean, we're dating casually. I mean, I, I said what? I didn't want anything serious. When did you say no, that? You, when yeah, you, you said that. Yeah, did, did she say that to I you? Didn't want you didn't tell me nothing. Y'all are tripping because I swear I said that. And Who you was know tripping? That, like, I'm not about being in a relationship. I, right I now. think you're not being in a relationship because your ass just got fucking caught. Yeah, this bitch is lying. Don't I guess I, I guess I don't know. I'll cut, you're cheating on me. I'm gonna call you whenever the fuck I want. Cheating on you? Yeah. I'm not a cheater. You're not a cheater. Fuck okay. you. Fuck this bullshit. I'm not gonna fuck you yeah. for like being this Some crazy bullshit. ass. Some bullshit. Trying to stalk me and bring yeah, it all the Yeah, we're the crazy ass. You're over here. Are you gonna add him to your collection too? I'm gonna make out a camera crew too. Yeah. You were, ask him out. Don't fuck off, honestly. Like, <laughs> you know what? It, I told you. I didn't even want to. No, 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 no. I think so. I will go fuck off. Now they they gotta be best friends now. I said what I had to say, and she let me know how she felt. Right, right, right. Yeah. You, you got to give me your contact information. Yes, I, sir. I just... <laughs> yes, sir. Get that. <laughs> boy, I got about to go fuck some hoes together, so man. Show people. I'm about to go on two men. Right. And then I'm, I can text you and everything. Oh, this oh, is oh, unfucking oh. believable. Yeah, I thought he was giving it to her, him, bro, to, uh, Warren. And like I said, dude, we're, we really weren't trying to like start anything like no, with you. No, like we're like, just trying to trying to figure out what was going on, and we did. Yeah, we just wanted to give Warren like an opportunity to like talk to her and stuff. But obviously, like you were here and stuff. No, so, I need yeah. this. I need this. I'm gonna I'm gonna head out now. Yeah, for sure, for sure. Bro, let's get sandwiches. Right on. Wow. He said, "Let's get a sandwich or something." What kind of fucking bro date is that? Not date, but bro. Whatever. Bro, let's get sandwiches. Right on. Sandwich is crazy. I ain't sandwich he was better off saying coffee wow wow <laughs> <laughs> nigga in disbelief <laughs> nigga dumbfounded bro <laughs> like you how did you click higher than them? like where'd you even find them don't worry about that yeah i'm worried about that you're that kind of person to do that what you you're mean kind of that, that kind of person who does this shit who First does all, who a does person, a person who telling. suspect that their girl is cheating, but apparently, Since when were you suspecting that? apparently, let you tell it though. We're not exclusive and we're not even dating, we so it don't ever. fucking matter at all. Like you were tripping. I'm, I'm not. Hey, I'm not tripping anymore. You let me know Good. where you stand, so I'm cool with that. I mean, yeah, I don't want to be with someone who's gonna hire a whole ass team to like find me. So now you admit it's a relationship, but when you said you weren't I mean, dating, in yeah, this make up, make up your mind. As far as I'm concerned, I'm over it. Yeah, I mean, I'm over all of this. Like, That's what the good. hell is going on over here? Good written. It's shocking me and all of this. Crazy, crazy ass. Shit. She really don't give a fuck, for real, honestly, in my eyes. She really don't give a fuck. She probably can have one of them back. Like that. Like, probably a uh, chase. Keep digging, Bianca. What? Digging? So whether you're dating. This wasn't a gold digger test. Sergio. What? Oh, fuck. Dating someone for three months, three years, or three freaking decades, a committed relationship is a committed relationship. Bianca said that she was not in a committed relationship with either Chase or Warren. Tough. Chase and Warren both denied this claim. However, I want to know what you guys think. Do That's you guys tough. think that Bianca was telling the truth? Fuck or no. do you guys think that she was just trying to manipulate the situation manipulate. by gaslighting and flipping everything on Warren and Chase? I really want to know your guys' thoughts on this. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. In the comments below. <laughs> bro, she's a manipulator, bro. Like, or tried to be. I don't know, that shit crazy, man. But anyway, man. Like, comment, subscribe. Turn on posties. <laughs> Put on rap and I switch my persona. Long as I use my aroma. Give me head in the back of the hummer. Hey.
I do this shit with no motherfucking cap and no gun. I deserve a diploma. Hey, if you catch me outside, then I'm rocking Margiela. I'm high as a bitch. I'm high as a bitch.